Hey guys, it's Michael from Devoted to Vinyl, and in this video, we're going to be talking about picture disc vinyl records. Did I waste my money? Now whether you've been collecting vinyl records for just a couple months or you've been collecting records for decades, the concept of picture disc vinyl records is nothing new. Picture disc vinyl records have been popular since the 1970s, when of course vinyl records were huge. But even today, people still want to buy picture disc records and the question is, should you? Now the answer to this question might actually seem simple, but if you're someone who's buying picture disc records thinking you're getting high fidelity audio, you might be disappointed when you put it on your turntable. Now a picture disc is made when you take paper inserts and you sandwich them in between thin layers of vinyl and then you press the grooves into a plastic laminate. Now picture discs look great, especially when you put them on display, but the question is do they sound great? And in my experience, the answer is no. I've never owned a lot of picture discs because I've really never had the desire to do so, but the ones that I I have have always sounded very noisy and in comparing a picture disc to a typical black or colored vinyl record I found that those records tend to be a lot cleaner and a lot smoother and a lot crisper when playing the music and I can hear the vocals and the instruments a lot better than I could on a picture disc. Now with all of that said I actually wouldn't discourage you from buying picture disc vinyl records I just think you should know what you're getting. Picture disc records are actually great for promotional use if you're a musician or you're in a band or in a group and you want to get your music pressed on vinyl, that might be a way to go. And if you're an everyday collector of vinyl records, picture discs are great to be able to get framed on your wall and show off to your friends and family. Just know that when you buy picture disc records, you're buying it first and foremost for the picture. The sound quality is really secondary in comparison to the promotional image that's put onto the surface of the record. So that's about it. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it if you would hit the like button. It helps other people like you find this video, so I would really appreciate it. And don't forget to also hit the subscribe button down below as well, because here on Devoted to Vinyl, I'm gonna be bringing you guys a lot more videos related to getting started in this vinyl hobby. And don't forget to comment down below this video too, because I would love to know, do you all collect picture disc records? Have you had picture disc vinyl records that sounded significantly better Better than you expected them to? Have you had ones that didn't even meet your very low expectations? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm going to be responding to as many comments as I can, and I can't wait to bring you guys another new video next week on this channel. Thanks for watching. Till then, talk to you later. What the hell was that? And once again, don't forget to comment down below. I actually really want to know, how do you like to, what am I talking about? Come on, son. Damn. Almost had that. That was pretty good.